If you've made top 64 to major, and if you've done this, and if you've done this, and uh, you know, maybe if you've got some extra. There's got to be the two crackles. Some extra reading in your corner. I don't know how to, try to transition this, but LRA start, I know, had been. Had he been just re reset it. LRA starts. All right, yeah. now we reset into yeah. a good transition. Yeah, you know, he's. He's been and he's been reading that the uh, the Wolf Bible apparently he's getting real set up with the, with this character and what would the Wolf Bible? Okay, say? yeah. What 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 does that mean? Is this so, a reference to something? No, it is. Well, yes and did no. someone write the Wolf Gospel? Like yes, what's going oh. effectively? There's and a Wolf said unto me. There's like a smash raw like a document, in the center, right? <laughs> and it will be good. And if it's not good, it will be fresh. It will be positive on shield. And you, Wolf said yeah, it was you good. Will, it will be good, it will be strong, and it will be plus. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, amen. <laughs> Gospel of Wolf 213. According to Fox McCloud. <laughs> yeah, written by his arch rival. Awesome. <laughs> the trick here with so many of these like so many of these like character matchups and blanket matchup statements in general, right? Is like Wolf is a generically strong, like has a lot of good everything. Yes. But you could argue doesn't ex exceptionally excel, at least in a top tier sense. Oh, right. At, no, balanced all at, around. Yeah. But just total, like, 8 out of 10s across the board. Yes. Meanwhile, Farm is playing one of, if not the most awkward champions around in this dog. And oh, this yeah. dog has got a lot going for him, but a lot not going for him. But the fact that you are forced to play, like, it can be awkward to play these generalists against a specialist character where, yeah, Fawn may, like, Duck Hunt may be a 3 out of 10 in some in occasions or in some instances. Yeah. But when you're encountering Fawn at, and Duck Hunt at a 10 out of 10 position, it sucks. <laughs> I mean, it does also depend on the player. It's kind of like of a, course, uh, right, you know, you need a good pilot. It's like regular Prego, and then you got, like, spicy Prego, right? Regular Prego is good, but spicy Prego on the right hands, ooh. I'm sorry, is that a sauce? Sauce. Okay. <laughs> I'm, not, I'm not as familiar with my commercial sauces, I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, you make your own sauces at home, huh? Hey, look, man. <laughs> look, you gotta give me some recipes we're, we're here. Poor boy hours we're here. We're Italian chicken. <laughs> ah, sei italiano. Okay. No, fammi sapere una ricetta. I don't speak the language you're made. Ah, excuse me. <laughs> Oops. It's okay, well, this is a whole ass mood. <laughs> it's like, it's like, why didn't you guys teach me Italian growing up? <laughs> why? <laughs> why didn't I grow up speaking the tongue? I, Damn I, it. You know, <gasps> so, so many questions, so little time. And, and the question is, why is L.A. start living to 178? Sometimes... Again, you just have you just have the airspeed, and honestly, mobility in general is oftentimes more important to survivability than sheer weight. Because we've Fair. seen how often like Bowser, the heaviest character in the game, can just get like stuck at ledge or uh, like edge guarded so easily. And Wolf can get edge guarded, but his airspeed can make him so hard to pin down that sometimes you just gotta make a raw call out and uh, calling out the fastball there from Fawn with that up air closing up the stock at 180. Oh, great get up attack there, avoiding the down smash. Will forward though sometimes. <laughs> right. Oh, but the can blowing up in Fawn's face. Yeah, as it's one stock apiece. Back airing the can there from LRA. That was really, really nice stuff. And closing out the stock with it. The short hop over the clay pigeon was so clean, and then you turn it into some solid damage. You got laser on deck as well, trying to continue the conversions. No fear. That's the benefit, right? Like, you may be trading with these cans or hitting can in general, but Wolf's disjointed claws may still Oh deactivate. my gosh, Ooh, what? Gets the fair bounce. flash. I think, did they bounce off the they platform? They bounce off the platform. Yeah, that'll. That's how that killed. That will do it. Fawn just like at the hand. Just, eh. Sometimes it happens. That's it why does, it small does. Small Battlefield's a real good stage for a lot of really neutral heavy characters. That Guess we can see your. Yeah, in. bounce right off. And then so Fawn just. <laughs> Doesn't just seem, it, and it very much seems like Fawn wasn't expecting to hit platform there. Oh gosh, no, no, they would have lived if they actually hit the stage. Pretty sure. Yeah. So you got to pivot here. Same matchup, same duology, maybe. Uh, per chance. Wait a minute. Ice climbers. Climbers. No. Really? Fawn is. A, I've never seen that before. Has some very, very deep pockets, and she'd be thinking about it. Considering her options. Yep, and here we committing go. to Reaching the cause. deep into those overalls. That's... 
I I don't know if I've ever seen the climbers from <laughs> I I'm scared. I've seen Granted. climbers do some crazy things at collision. Oh yeah. Like these these two uh, these two are the master of the late meta. Uh, you know, a couple of war crimes on legs like Honestly, climbers. I thought we left them behind them for all, but nope. No. Here they are. They're still here. Crazy. Sakurai's favorites. It's like the the difference when it comes to late meta climbers is that they have a lot more decent setups. A, you can do it out of the dash, you can do it out of an up air, and like these very, very common moves. Mm -hmm. um, Squall Hammer's insane. Solo po. Aww, um, mana. That is, that is the risk though. Like you know, you drop one stock and now you've got to play. Let's through go, it. Nana. And see what I mean? Desync Squall Hammer is just so so strong. Oh, okay. but <laughs> Oh my gosh, both of them just. You know, it also just makes me Ooh. sad to like see the ice timers get hit. They're too cute. All right, but it looks like LRA starts going to be running Something. away with this if they keep this up. Uh, okay. Oh, <laughs> going for it, trying for it. I almost want to see like, I want to see more dash attack coming out from Fron. I feel like she's trying to like set up a little bit too hard with some of these like desync uh, yeah, opportunities. And granted, you get one there, but Nana comes in a little bit too late with the spike. Oh my gosh, the double parry. Ooh. That's a big punish. Yeah, we're not seeing a lot of the use of these specials here. Not even like the little Ices or the Freeze Breath. All right, Ash. looks like, uh, ooh, that might be death. Nope, still living. In total free fall there, but Fawn doesn't, uh, is able to get back to the ledge. LRA looking for a potential edge guard. Oh, and there it is. Wow. Fawn going down 2-0. Oh. I, like, I get it, right? Or, ice Climbers at top level. Mm -hmm. Give Spacey's a real hard time. Like, we've seen that with um, Big D and his positive records on, uh, namely, Jackal and Light. Mm -hmm. Just, yeah, like, these are the, those are, that's one, that's the Fox and one of the Wolves. And right. They, he just made the matchup seem super, super hard. But. Unfortunately, Fawn, I don't think they really know the follow ups here for the ICs. I mean, the pressure just wasn't there for the shield, and LRAs were just punishing everything they threw out. And I will say, some of the Ice Climbers follow ups aren't that difficult. Like, you mm -hmm. can do all the crazy stuff, or you can, like, get Squall Hammer triple up air, and it still does 60. Like, that's still very, very good. Oh, yeah. Uh, but it was almost like too much reliance on trying to get the, the cheeky, like, up till um, desync setups, right. like desync the squall hammer, like not a lot of threat around the burst range, not trying to like threaten a lot of offensive space, which Correct. let LRA just kind of do these like really basic short hops in, like short hop late in air, separate the climbers, mm -hmm. go, like, and and off to and off to the races he was, and off yep. to into losers finals he goes.